the night. Sort of Ganguly, he's collected some minutes' time. Honorary President of the BCCI, Mr. Jay Shah, Honorary Secretary of the BCCI. Well done, gentlemen, for putting this tournament together. 20 crore rupees to MS Dhoni and the trophy. What a, what a performance. story behind the turnaround from last year to this year. It's not easy. Almost the same players other than Moin and Robin and you just conjured performances out of the same players. I think before I start talking about CSK, uh, I feel it's important that I talk about KKR. Uh, the way or the, the, the position they were in at the first half uh, of IPL, you know, it is very difficult from that position to come back and, you know, do what they have really done. Uh, if any team deserved to, you know, win this year's IPL, I feel it was KKR. And big credit to the support staff and all the players because it's not really easy. Whenever the team is not doing well, you know, it's a very difficult task. I think the break really helped them, uh, but tremendous performance. Now, coming to CSK, uh, again, we, we, you know, we shuffled a few players. We used them in different ways and uh, important was to take the responsibility. And I felt we, we had match winners, you know, coming game after game, you know, performing and doing really well. So, people who are in form, they made sure that they are scoring throughout the tournament and everybody else was chipping in. MS, so many finals over the years, but as you peel back the years, do they become a little more special? Well, it's a difficult one. Every final is special. Uh, but also, you know, uh, if you start looking at the stats, uh, you may say, okay, we are the most consistent team that actually loses in the final because that's also a fact. Uh, but there have been a few finals where uh, we lost because of that one brilliant performance or, you know, a span of 15 minutes where something happened and we lost the game. So, uh, I, I feel it, it's very important to come back strong, especially in the knockout stages and, you know, give performances where you don't let the opposition creep in to the game so uh, that's something that uh, we made a conscious attempt to do and you know I, I hope that in the coming seasons you know CSK will be known for that you know when, when you've got, got a chance to win the game you know very plain and simple win it and move forward. So many experienced players in your side and they all stood up today whether it was Faf, whether it was Bravo, whether it was Robin, whether it was Moeen. What kind of conversations do you have with them ahead of such a big final? <laughs> Frankly, nothing. You know, so, I thought so. Yeah, we, we don't really talk a lot, but uh, it's more one-on-one -on -one conversation. So our practice sessions, I, I feel our, your practice sessions are more like a meeting sessions also where somebody, it's more relaxed and, you know, people are more open and they talk and we see as to what really is happening. The moment you get into a team room and, you know, start talking about stuff, you know, there's a different sort of pressure. And as cricketers, I feel 20 minutes is the max we can have concentration on, you know, the moment you start talking about strategies and everything. So I feel our practice sessions uh, have been really good and that's where uh, you know we have uh, communicated very well with the players. Well it's thanks to the team you know because you can't really win uh, without having a good team uh, but also individuals you know once you get into the knockout stages from a team sport it also becomes an individual sport where you know you may come up with 10, 10 minutes of special performance and that can really help you win the game so it is a team sport but the moment you get into the knockout make sure that if you are somebody who is doing well you know you keep doing well and if you have not contributed a lot it could be that one or two performance that can really help the team win the trophy. MS, just look around here, even here in Dubai, everybody is in yellow. Your fans have supported you very much. So, do one thing, just look into that camera there and get Talai to speak to the fans. What does what he want to tell them? I would, I, I would love to thank them, you know, uh, wherever we have played. Uh, okay, we are in Dubai right now, but even when we have played in South Africa, whether it was Durban, Johannesburg, you know, all the different places, uh, we have always got good number of CSK fans. And you know, that's what you really crave for because you want to play cricket, you want to play good cricket, but you want people to come and you know admire the cricket that we are playing. So thanks to all of them, you know it, it definitely feels like Chipot, you know, it feels as if we are playing in Chennai. But uh, you know hopefully next year we will be back in Chennai for the fans and you know they can come in full house, big numbers, and you know enjoy the performances. So thanks a lot to all of them. Can I ask one final question on their behalf? Does Talai come back next year? 
Well, again, I've said that in in a pre-match conference. Yes, you know, yes. basically, it depends on BCCI. You know, with two uh, two new teams coming no, in, uh, yes. that's that's no, a bad no, start. No, if this is you and CSK. It's not about them. No, but we we have to decide what is good for CSK. You know, uh, it, it's not really about me being there in the top three or four, whatever the retained number of players is. You know, it's about uh, you know making a strong core and you know making sure that. Uh, the franchise doesn't really suffer because it will be an auction where you have to make team for the next 10 years. You know, we were definitely in 2008 the core group that carried on for more than 10 years, but we'll have to have a hard look as to in the next 10 years who are the people you know will contribute in similar manner. And you can be so proud of the legacy you left behind for Chennai Super Kings, and they can build on it. Ladies and gentlemen, what a man, what a leader, MS Dhoni. But still, I haven't left behind. Huh? No, you're not. I'm glad to hear that. There we go. We got a comment on a whim at the end. And we leave MS Dhoni to go now and pick up the trophy that he has collected three times in the past. This is the fourth for MS Dhoni for Chennai Super Kings. There he goes. Saurabh Ganguly and Jay Shah. Chennai Super Kings name on the Vivo IPL trophy for the fourth time in their history. One behind the Mumbai Indians now. They are winners once again. Well, there it is, uh, Jay Shah and Saurabh Ganguly presenting MS Dhoni with the Vivo. IPL trophy where talent meets opportunity so much of that involved in the Chennai Super Kings team franchise and everything to do with the men in yellow the supporters some of the best Deepak Chahar recently engaged congratulations to him and the whole Chennai Super Kings franchise once again a magnificent story they talk about experience added a sprinkling of youth. They are family through and through as well. You can see that. Yeah, jump in. Jump in the photo. Get yourself in there, kids. Enjoy the moment. Celebrate. Celebrate with the family. They are one family. The Chennai Super Kings. Fourth trophy to prove it tonight. M.S. Dhoni, well spoken, well led.